Well, would you look at this? We got ourselves a decent day, so we're gonna work on the van today. Just plugging in our solar panels right now to make sure that they are working with our generator, make sure everything's working because we're gonna get up there today and install the solar panels. Oh shit. Oh shit. My girl looking so beautiful in the sun. So we're rocking the Goal Zero Yeti 1400. <laughs> it's an all-in-one generator, charge panel. I don't know anything about solar. So we decided to get this because it is an all-in-one kind of plug-and-play option. You plug in your solar, you plug in anything else you, you want to charge, and it's good to go. Oh, hi there. My first time up on the roof, team. You gonna come up here, too? No. No, come on, you got it. No. All right, we made it up here on the roof. This is kind of how it looks up here. It's actually weird standing up here. It does not feel safe, but uh, we're up here. I figure once we move in, it might be kind of cool to like do yoga and shit up here, like in the sunshine. Think about it. Sunroof here, fan right here. It's gonna look good. All right, drilling a hole in this roof right now for the first time is crazy. Look at that. First hole in the van, this is the hole is done. The next step here is I put all this Gorilla gorilla tape. Little bits here and there. These are rated for like 15 pounds or so. I think these panels are like 3 pounds, so it should handle it. Now let's go. Okay, it's the next day. Let me show you what I did. Got both panels mounted here. Use this stuff here called Eternabon tape. And this is like roof sealant tape. And it actually works really good. So it basically creates a seal. Underneath there, you saw the Gorilla Tape. And then I kind of put uh, sealant. You don't really need this. This is kind of like just extra protection because I wasn't sure how well it was gonna seal. And it seals really good. Uh, we've got some water here. As you can tell on the panel, but these are resistant to water. <laughs> they say you can walk on these solar panels, but I don't really want to. <laughs> and then we got this fan installed, but that's for tomorrow's vlog. Someone put those together. Watch me take them apart. <sighs> this is not easy. I stripped a lot of the screws when I was building this. Anyway, through all my fixing, I've just stripped all the screws and then I painted over all of them, so. Okay, I'm done. That did not go well. There's a lot of screws still stuck in there, so far. So part of the failed frame experiment was that all these boards have screws sticking out of them now, and they got these freaking metal things stuck to them. Uh, and they're pretty cracked too, so I'm gonna chop them up and see if I could salvage what's left. Still not working. All right, that's the vlog for today, guys. I'm feeling exhausted. I'm just tired. I'm just done, if you can't tell. All the, the, the whole thing, and then the fan, and then the... Tune in tomorrow to see... <laughs> today, you saw us install the solar panels, but on the next vlog, we're gonna install the Max Air fan. Uh, so make sure you stick around for that one. Subscribe if you wanna see in a couple months the final product of this freaking van build that we've been going so hard at and uh yeah just leave a like a comment all that good stuff just, just do it because if you didn't do it it might make me sad and fuck